The light of the sun appears white, but in fact contains light of all different colours, which is a phenomenon you can see if you shine light through a prism. The different colours of light refract, which basically means bend, at different angles depending on their wavelength. Red has a longer wavelength than blue light, so will bend less. A rainbow is formed when sunlight shines through lots of tiny clusters of water all acting as prisms. And notice how the blue light pulls a much tighter curve than the red light has. In a similar way, molecules in the atmosphere such as nitrogen will scatter blue light more than red light. So imagine a path taken from start to finish for a red light. It goes pretty much straight there, whereas a blue light is scattered a lot more. What this means is once the sunlight is in the atmosphere, blue light will be scattered into our eyes from lots more places than the red light has been, meaning that the sky is blue. If sunlight travels a long way through the atmosphere, most of the blue light's already been scattered, so the only light that gets through is red light, which is the reason the sky is red at sunset. In space, there's no gas to scatter the light of stars or the sun, and so stars appear white and the rest of the sky is black.